Good evening, wherever you are on this uh, most pleasant evening. There has been a clamour to get inside the ground tonight for a much-anticipated game. The uh, roads outside of the stadium have been bumper to bumper with traffic. The car parks are full. There is a torrent of humankind making its way from the nearby station and we expect every seat to be filled. An atmosphere of uh, great expectation and excitement. It is a venue this which simply adds to the spectacle of the game it stages. One of the most impressive arenas in this part of the world. And from the team sheet, we derive that they are going with a 3-4-3 formation, Jim. Yeah, I'm a fan of this shape, Peter. Managers that set up this way are, are willing to back their players to execute what is a, an aggressive attacking intent. Goals are, are very much in mind, while you hope to keep outscoring the opposition, knowing you're, you're probably bound to let a few in. But essentially, this is a real front foot football and can be very exciting. So it's down to business here. Tries to get it forward quickly. A nice touch. Incoming cross. No messing about, just bludgeoned away. That's a good block, but at the expense of a corner. And that has sent him sprawling. He's got options in the box if he gets his head up. Cut out in the nick of time. No efforts on target is acceptable if levels of enthusiasm and energy are good, and they're not. Tried to play it through. Ah, oh, that just required a bit more oomph to reach its target. And it's played forward. Played out to the right. Gorgeous control there. There are a few waiting for it. Oh, that's nice. A chance to play it in. A really good feat from him. Forward it goes. And it's been intercepted, and that will come to nothing. Good spell of possession, this, but very little to show for it. That's a throw. Half time. So both sides have drawn blanks. They have toiled at times, but it's not been a bad game by any means. So your views on the first half? Well, this has proved a very frustrating day so far, especially for the strikers. Nothing has been created for them. I think the service has been extremely poor. An intriguing half, lacking only in goals. The score nil nil. Here we go again then. Well, the first half didn't really produce the goals we'd have liked. Hopefully, they've been safe for the, the second. For that to be the case, though, we'll need to see more energy and invention early on. Plenty waiting in the middle. He's there to a big chance! 
It's a goal! And the second half is off to a flyer! Oh, high-quality goal, lovely first touch, sumptuous second. Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. Well, whatever the manager said in that dressing room at half-time, it's worth the treat. Gets it back. What a good way to assert your authority for this second period. They were prepared to commit numbers forward into attacking positions, and the risk has been deservedly rewarded. Time to deliver. to the flank it's found its way to him could cross it here out towards the flank keeps everyone guessing chooses to go back real chance in it goes two up now and they are cruising The keeper deserves some sympathy there. He may not have seen that until too late. Checks on the touchline, a change about to occur. So that's two now without reply. Well, with this kind of authority, Peter, why not push on and, and totally kill this off? Oh, they've seen lots of the ball. Trying to go for it a bit, a bit of creativity and adventure. Plays it out to the wing. That intervention was very necessary. There really wasn't very much in that far away from being a telling final ball. Ah, quality deserted them when they really needed it. He's on his way. Coaxed through there. Looking for a decent ball in. Only partially clear. And now they can launch a counter. Battles to win it back. Whistle's gone, that's a foul. Oh, that is lovely footwork. Assistant referee rightly gives him offside. <laughs> and 
And the referee brings it to a close. And the manager heads down the tunnel, swathed in satisfaction. And his team have carried out his instructions to the word, and they have got their win. Your reflections then, Jim. Look, we saw some textbook football from wide areas that continued to produce expansive attacking play that was ultimately too hard to handle. They were simply too good in, in the wide areas. And if that wasn't hard enough for the opposition, the link-up play was outstanding too. And that's where we have to end it. From me, Peter Drury, and my co-commentator, Jim Beglin, a very good evening to you.